Uh, over and under. Um, what do you think is going to happen? Strike, ban, or nothing? Um, I mean, the worst of their stuff was on, like, Rumble. I don't think that'll affect YouTube much. You don't think so? I'm pretty confident that if you're out here doing Nazi signs, I'm pretty sure even if you're on another platform, it doesn't matter. Really well, YouTube doesn't really have policies like that. Could it put you on somebody's radar? I guess it's possible. The question is going to be if a whole bunch of other content creators start making reaction pieces to that. I think that would see if it gets on people's um, radar. I don't think they care. I don't think they care if it's on another platform. I'm pretty sure they do have a policy that if you do behavior that's extreme, even off-platform, they will come for you, for sure. I mean, they've already banned a bunch of people for stuff they said on other platforms. That's pretty standard social media stuff. They've done that for uh, different large political figures, obviously, but they've well, also done that for creators. I've only seen that happen, yeah, with huge blowback. So, like, um, obviously, like, Andrew Tate. Um, yeah, because yeah. he didn't say anything on YouTube, and they fucked his shit up. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Refreshing, but at that level, I'm not sure. Yeah. I also think, like, in a weird way, I feel like it just takes one news article to be like white supremacy is flourishing on YouTube. <laughs> yeah, like a New York Times article. Yeah, something like that. Yeah, yeah and then that shit's a wrap. That shit is over. I think one thing YouTube hates more than anything is just bad press. It yeah, just everybody hates. Yeah, that's why when that's the reason why quote unquote canceling is so effective. As soon as somebody gets shown, people are like, oh, we're firing that guy because <laughs> they don't want to deal with the review bombs. They don't want to deal with the lingering after effects of people targeting their shit. Like, yeah. Which is understandable. It's like there's no reason for them to want to. Like they're thinking about their bottom line. Uh, like I'm gonna do whatever it takes. Sure. So if you have to take a bet, uh, let's say within yeah. one month, I think there's a 90% chance that they will be not banned. Um, within six to 12 months, I think the chance of them getting banned is will increase. But it's only going to depend if they keep doing this type of content. Like if they just did their hit piece on you guys, uh, and I guess the entire black race, uh, and they um, move on from that, then. I think that they'll probably be okay because it seems like they've gotten by so far. With I don't think have they ever gotten a strike before. Uh no, but I don't think they've ever done anything as crazy as the uh, taking their picture and changing it to a monkey. True. Yeah, that's on their platform. My money is on a strike coming down by middle of next week. Damn, Jesus! At minimum. That's my money. Because, I, I mean, the rules are pretty clear. And so they definitely won't come for that booty. But we'll we'll right. have to see. We'll see. I appreciate that, Destiny. All right. Bye. Remember to hit that like and subscribe. And don't forget the notification bell so that my videos show up right in your feed.